East Coast Health Reviews. Today we got another beer review. Today we're reviewing Presidente. And I have beer advocate pulled up here. So beer advocate score on this one. Um, so they don't like this. Score 64 for poor. Style, lager adjunct. Uh, like most adjunct lagers, uh, beer advocate usually gives them a low score. And style, lager adjunct, ABV, 5%. From Cerveceria National, National Dominicana, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Uh, part of the, well, it's from the Dominican Republic. Availability is year-round. Um, and there's a decent amount of notes, but I'm not really going to read that. Let's just dive into the beer. So I did buy this um, as the 40-ounce. I was going to do a 40-ounce video. Um... But as you guys may know, I can't really do 40 ounce videos anymore. So I'm just going to do a review on it. Um, looks pretty good. Green bottle. Little hesitant about the green bottle. Hopefully it's not scoped. But uh, yeah, I got my Spencer glass here. And uh, yeah, let's crack this open and we'll go over the appearance with you guys. Go for the pour. Looks like a lot of carbonation. Lots of bubbles. Clear golden color. About a finger white head. Looks like it's gonna leave a nice lacing on the glass. Yeah, lots of bubbles in there. Let's go for the nose. Lots of sweet corn. Is it skunky? Um, I think a little bit. A little bit of skunk. I don't really mind. Kind of smells like a Heineken in my opinion. Not too offensive. Um, where they had this was right in the front in a cooler. Um, so I'm guessing maybe it got a little skunky from the light, but it's not too bad. Besides that, it's got a good amount of sweetness. Um, like I said, sweet corn. Grainy, pretty grainy. Barley malt. Bready. Slightly grassy. Grassy and floral. It smells good though, in my opinion. Like I said, right up front you get the sweet corn. Barley malt, bready, grainy, slightly grassy, slightly grassy hops. Um, besides a little bit of skunkiness, it smells pretty good in my opinion. Let's uh let's try this one. Medium to high carbonation. Oh, something in my eye. Let's say definitely light mouth feel. Um, it, it is a little watery, but it's good. Kind of like the aroma. Lots of sweet corn. Nice breadiness. Uh, lots of barley malt as well. Slightly dry, grassy finish. Grainy, bready, malty. I like it. It's pretty good. It's actually very smooth, very uh, crisp and clean. This 40 ounce was like $3. Not a bad price. Um, kind of just like your typical Pilsner. Adjunct lager. Pretty good in my opinion. Very soup, uh, very smooth. Super smooth. Super crisp. Clean. Drinkable. Crushable. 
yeah, for the most part. I like the amount of carbonation it has. I like how smooth it goes down. I like how it has a, a really good amount of uh, sweet corn, so it's got a good amount of sweetness. And it's not overly dry. Um, it's definitely, it's nowhere near bitter, bitter. Just a nice, slight, dry, hot finish. Not bad. Cyclops scale. I'm going to say three out of five sugar cubes. Good amount of sweetness. And like two, let's say two, two out of five hop cones. Because um, it does have a slightly dry finish to it. But like I said, very smooth, crisp, clean, drinkable, crushable, however you guys want to put it. Definitely a very clean beer. Um, I can see myself going through this 40 ounce pretty quick. Um, I can see myself drinking this on a nice hot summer day. Like you would with most uh, adjunct lagers because they're light and uh, they got a decent flavor. And like I said, what I like about this, in my opinion is the high carbonation. I really do enjoy the high carbonation. That's something that's always big with me. If a beer has a good amount of uh, carbonation and it's light, <laughs> I definitely have no trouble um, drinking a good amount of it. <laughs> Especially if it's hot outside. You don't want something that's too filling. I'm not sure. The price on a six pack. If you guys know the price on a six pack, leave a comment down below. Like I said, I'm pretty sure I paid around three dollars for this forty ounce. Not a bad price. Um, nothing really offensive with this beer, besides the the aroma having a slight skunky aroma, uh, but it's probably because it's in the green bottle. Um, but as far as the taste of the beer, it actually tastes really good. No off flavors on the taste. Um, so for a rating. This is good. I'm going to give this a, I'm going to say 7 out of 10. Um, and I am going to recommend it to you guys. If you guys see it 40 ounces, recommend picking it up. Definitely a nice, crushable, drinkable beer. Um, I've never, I don't think I've had a Dominican beer before. And I don't think I've ever had a uh, Dominican beer reviewed. Um, so this is nice to try. Like I said, I'm going to recommend it to you guys if you guys like uh adjunct lagers um if you want something that's very drinkable good amount of carbonation and super smooth i recommend trying this one out like i said seven out of ten i think it's a good uh, rating for this one if anybody knows the price of the six packs leave a comment down below let me know and uh yeah there you have it is there anything else that you guys like to see on my channel definitely leave a comment down below and don't forget to like and subscribe to my upcoming videos and like your beer thanks for watching guys cheers